Welcome to our prayer journey with my Toad Daily Devotion. Is it just me? Or are lies abounding now more than ever? I mean, when I was younger, I knew there were some lies. But now, it is almost impossible to tell the truth. Perhaps that goes with the territory that people do not believe there is a such thing as truth. Maybe that is what it is. It has come to the point where Isaiah 59, 4 fits perfectly. None call it for justice, nor any plea it for truth. They that trust it in vanity and speak lies, they conceive mischief and bring forth iniquity. That's what our nation seems to be doing now. In fact, that is what the world seems to be doing now. Unfortunately, we may have a country like Russia attacking into Ukraine, but they seem to be more aware of some truths than we are in our country who cannot see the dangers of war and different things that are happening because we have a head in different narratives and a bunch of lies. So what is a Christian to do? Well, we only have one calling to do. We cannot get discouraged. We need to speak the truth in love when we have an opportunity. We need to call out lies when we see them and have a realm of influence. We need to keep hard and be in God's word, trusting him to deliver. Because in the end, he wins. And we win by default. God is the way, so we need to spend more time praying. You know, I got to admit, sometimes I don't pray as well until I see these lies overwhelming our country. And then what do I do? I go before God and I say, God, I can't do this. I can't handle it. Give me the strength to stand up and do something. You know, I'm praying for revival. I'm praying for a great awakening. I see some things happening you know, perhaps the Lord's going to be back tomorrow. Perhaps not. But I see turning in the sense of this, that some of the things that happened back when I saw this earlier in my life are happening today. People, maybe less, are moving toward God and praying more earnestly. Less people, but more earnestly. People in culture are turning back things from what they were in the past. And there's an uproar. People are loud. Usually what's happening in a society, when people are loud and against you, it's because their world view is starting to fall apart. Continue to pray. Continue to be in Christ and asking out for God to change this world. It happens one person at a time, one salvation message at a time. If you get an opportunity, explain to somebody the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. Or share one of these videos and tell them in the description is a link that tells them how they can get saved. So until next time, may Jesus increase as we decrease.